hello friends today in this tutorial i'll be showing you that how to build a web based video editor kind of a application inside your browser itself inside python so basically this is a screenshot of that this application here you can add or merge multiple videos inside the browser itself and for this we will be using a python library called as movie by this is a very open source python audio and video processing library it makes the video editing job way more easier this is its official website it is made by a person which is this developer so moviepy is a very very popular python module for video editing which can be used for basic operation like cutting of video concatenating it title insertion all these stuffs so we will be integrating this library inside a GUI framework which is a web framework which is popularly known as Flask. There are two majorly frameworks first is Django and second is Flask. Flask also has its uh, developers out there so it's it really got a good documentation out there so we will be integrating it inside this uh, Flask application MoviePy. So you can see this is let me start this application so if you see here inside my console now to start this there is a command out there we bat file we have written so we, we are starting this windows start bat file so as i start this you will see now this uh, started my flask application at localhost 5000 so if i open this address inside the browser so basically the nice thing about this video editor that you will uh, see a live preview so it will also have a live video preview it will render it side by side so there is a choose file button if you click it you will be redirected to select your video file so you can select any extension mp4 avi mov webm any file if you select the first file you need to give it a name so i will give it a, as first and then there is the upload button if i click this you will now see a progress bar and also this toast message that video is successfully uploaded so this makes it very much easy for the customer whoever is using this product inside the browser so you will see this preview here you will see that this is a video here which is playing here side by side so then this is the first here you can also play this like this by using this button it will render the preview if you want to remove it you can click the remove button so this will remove the video so let me upload this once again so you can also trim this video guys this is the video effects out there uh, let's suppose this is a 13 seconds long video i only need the first five seconds so i will simply start from zero to five and there is a trim option so basically i can trim this video so now you will see this progress bar which is the video is rend rendering and in the command line you will see this process happening in the command line so this command is executing this process and you can also see the progress which is there inside the command line so when it is completed it will write this video file inside the directory so inside the clips folder you will now see your directory this is a trimmed file you can see that so it has trimmed this so this is the edited portion so this is only contain the first five seconds you can see that the first five seconds it only contains you can see that and this is one approach and now guys let's suppose you want to merge so firstly we will upload the first file and again we choose another file the second file that we and this time we put the name as second again upload this so we have now two files which is this is the first video file if i render this preview this is 13 second long and this is a second video file if i render this you can see this is nine second long you can also view it in full screen like this so you can also download this as various options are also present out there so after this there is a merge clips option is also there so if i click merge so it is now rendering it so 
merging uh, concatenating the videos takes a lot of time because uh, there is encoding in involved in this process so that's why you are seeing that uh, the progress bar is moving in a very slow fashion so encoding is involved that's why it is taking too much time so for longer videos you need to wait in the browser because it takes a lot of memory and also it takes a lot of computing prop power as well so if you are hosting this on live website then obviously if you are using hosting it on virtual private server vps you need to be buying a pretty good plan to host this uh, intensive video intensive website because many users will be performing the operation simultaneously so you need to be having a good hosting plan for this so so when it is reaches 100% your process will be completed so guys if you are watching it for the very first time then please hit the like button subscribe the channel and also hit the like button so this is the application if you want the full source code regarding this application guys i have written a complete blog post on my tutorial website coding section so step by step instruction is given so lastly there you will be a github repository simply you can clone this or download this on side your machine so instruction is given so this was the application guys that i wanted to show you thanks very much